ABO came at a time when I was in GRCC and I didn't have nowhere to turn back against the wall. Maybe this isn't for me. Um, at a time where I, I, I felt like quitting, and it wasn't so much academic, it more it was I didn't have a support system. So ABO became my support system. There were challenges. Me being a first generation college student, I didn't know enough or essential things that I needed to know here on campus. But being a part of Alpha Beta Omega, ABO has helped me overcome those challenges. With ABO being there, they kind of shine the light and make you feel like you can help yourself. For some people in this, you know, in their generation, they come from uh, college graduates. It's, it's a lot easier for them to navigate because their parents or somebody they know close has has been in there. Where ABO provides that second option for someone who doesn't know it and comes from a circumstances where there wouldn't be a resource there. It's a leadership development program. ABO just doesn't provide tutors, assist with transportation, and assist with hunger here on campus. They also develop us as individuals and kind of prepare us for society. ABO being here kept me on track, um, and even now I'm on track to go to Calvin Seminary starting in the fall of 2018. My goal in going to Calvin Seminary or coming here for social work is to, to free those that are lost too, is to let them know, look man, there's, there's more out here than that. What, what are you really accomplishing? To just go inside people's minds and be able to hear them spiritually, physically, you know, if you take care of their physical needs, maybe then we can have a spiritual conversation about who you are and what you're doing in life. After GRCC, I plan on attending Grand Valley State University, where I will major in psychology. One of the biggest things I want to do is change the culture of my family, and I'm going about that by creating tradition of attending college.